we came to publish in the Biomed Central Journal because uh, I approve of open access publishing. And so I was looking around for journals that used that model. And uh, Biomed Central uh, has very broad coverage and uh, there was a number of journals that were suitable for the sorts of things we wanted to publish. The process of publishing in the journal was extremely smooth. Uh, we submitted, uh, we got very reasonable comments back from the reviewers, uh, uh, we dealt with those and uh, I thought the editorial work was, was uh, very balanced. As far as the submission posters went, at the time, uh, w particularly when I did the first one, uh, the, uh, the web interface for doing the submission was much better with Biomed Central than it was with comparable journals. Uh, of the re using the regular model. We published a fairly specialist paper, uh, the first one I published in Biomed Central, and that was uh, picked up on by people uh, from a quite different field from the one we were targeting the paper at, uh, and that was very gratifying. I got emails from them within a few days of publication. The, the best thing about publishing in Biomed Central uh, was the very fair reviewing and uh, editorial policy I experienced. Uh, in some of the extremely high profile traditional journals, um, reviewers can't resist asking you to do something, even if it doesn't really add to the main story. And that was not an experience I had with Biomed Central. I think open access publishing is uh, clearly the way of the future for um, libraries and the academic community. Um, as far as I understand it, almost all university libraries are under incredible pressure uh, on their budgets and the profit motive in, in traditional publishing seems to be um, still too dominant and uh, open access, uh, the open access movement uh, is I think going to drive uh, a change in the policy. So the issue of cost for libraries is a real one. Uh, our library here has uh, in, in the last few years decided not to take an electronic subscription to the back issues of one of the major uh, several of the major publishers uh, because of the expense, the annual expense of renewing the, the electronic subscription. And um, only last week I found that a serious inconvenience. Uh, back to 1990 was fine, but anything before then has evaporated. I think institutions uh, that are of a specialised nature and whose libraries may not take uh, a subscription to a wide range of journals, uh, then uh, the open access model is of course of great advantage because uh, people working in those institutions will be able to get access to the entire literature whether or not it's in their particular field. Another advantage of open access uh, of course is that people in the developing world uh, have complete access to the literature which uh, even the major journals they often don't get access to uh, with the conventional model. Over the last year, few years I've found uh, that the way I use the literature is, has changed completely. Uh, everything now happens with the computer uh, and uh, my normal mode of working is to go to PubMed, uh, search, uh, and then cl click on the links. When I see one of those little icons uh, for the open access to the, uh, to the, the full document, uh, I'm more likely to read that work. One of the uh, advantages of uh, online publishing uh, is the ability to put high quality color images and movies uh, into your work. Uh, at no extra cost, um, which uh, is something that isn't always the case uh, with the conventional journals. Um, I certainly found that submitting images to uh, Biomed Central uh, has been very easy. Uh, you don't have to make a, a PDF uh, at a lower resolution for the reviewers. You can send the full thing along uh, and that isn't, also isn't always the case. I think one of the interesting things for the future is that instead of having an uh, impact factor for an individual journal, uh, things like Google Scholar and PubMed are uh, implementing uh, continual tracking methods that will allow each individual paper to receive its own profile uh, for its own importance and its own use within the community. Certainly the enthusiasm for open access and particularly knowledge about open access publishing is becoming much more widespread. There was a time when I would mention it to people and they would look completely blank and now almost everybody uh, knows about the issue. As far as I'm concerned, uh, I think that uh, publishing through open access is doing the right thing.